Hi everybody, my name is Mozo and today we're gonna talk about Drop Dead Dual Strike Edition. It's a game that is in the Oculus Quest since the beginning. It's a very nice game, it remembers me of an old arcade game called House of the Dead. You probably already play it, you probably already enjoy it. And, and that is, is just like this game, you are static on one point and you shoot a lot of zombies and then when the numbers of zombies exhaust you go for the next checkpoint the game takes you to the next checkpoint there is no teleport there is no free movement the game just takes you to the next point and then you focus only on get your hands on the, your weapon that is on your belt and shoot the zombies as fast as you can that is the primary goal of the game well let's talk about graphics the game is pretty beautiful it's really well rendered it's there is it's simple graphics but really well made the colors are very shiny the, the zombies are very shiny green but there's a lot of yellow and red the game is has a nice palette of colors it's, it's really nice looking game visually talking and the sound is pretty good as well the synth sound effects then the, the sound of the guns and the music when there is music and also the voice acting is pretty good you will help two other NPCs there is an old man and his young daughter and your party will try to avoid the apocalypse zombie in this game you are a kind of mutated soldier and you have this ability to travel back in time and you're gonna travel back to avoid the zombie infestation this zombie infestation was created by a mad scientist called Dr. Monday and this guy planned to take over the world by turning everyone into a zombie so you're gonna have to take all the way back and try to avoid his evil plans there is more or less I can remember now but kind of 12 to 15 stages and you're gonna have to go through these stages to end the game but not only one time you're gonna have to go through these stages for three times you have three timelines to play this game uh, you might think there is this is kind of boring I'm gonna have to repeat the stages but there's there's a difference here. each timeline has new elements new enemies new functions new weapons and the story changes a little bit so it, this this keeps you interested this keeps you going on and, and playing the game and keeps you interested in the game <laughs> you know what I'm talking about well uh, the guns are pretty good, it's pretty good looking, the, the feeling of getting the gun on your belt and shooting the zombies is, is amazing. This game, this, game, this game is really fun, it's a really fun game, I enjoy it a lot. It is, I'm talking about its campaign of course, it has a horde mode, a survival mode, that is pretty interesting too. I don't like it but... Uh, some people like it, you will defend you to death and there is there is five stages for that there is a cooperative mode that you're gonna you're gonna have a friend to play along with I did not try this cooperative mode yet but I will bring it later to the channel as soon as I got tested with a friend so that's it, I enjoyed a lot this game, the price is just down below I'm leaving my pros and cons points here and leave your commentary on the description down below if you enjoyed this video please hit that like button subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon so you stay tuned to the next videos I got on virtual reality anyway I ask forgiveness for my bad English I'm trying my best here to make myself understandable okay see you on the next one that's it let's go bye Work, kid. Accuracy is important. Ready?